We saw two distinctive moments in the first of the two Democratic primary debates. The first was on health care, when the entire field was asked whether they would abolish private insurance, and only two candidates raised their hands, Elizabeth Warren and Bill de Blasio. And the second, of course, was a clash between Julian Castro and Beto O'Rourke on immigration. That's an issue that hasn't gotten a lot of focus in the Democratic field, and Julian Castro is one of the leading candidates in terms of releasing a particularly progressive immigration policy. And he got the opportunity to show it off tonight and really have a standout moment. There weren't any major gaffes tonight. I don't think we're going to see anybody sort of fall in the polls because of uh, Tuesday night's debate. But there was a major standout moment for Julian Castro on immigration, um, for instance. Cory Booker's team felt that he had a standout moment on gun control. Amy Klobuchar in particular spoke out on uh, abortion and got one of the biggest cheers in the room tonight. So those candidates may get more attention than they have in, in the past. They've been pulling in sort of the low single digits. Bill de Blasio was a surprise coming out of the first debate. I, I think he uh, was not taken particularly seriously when he got into the field. And we sort of saw him go after a number of his opponents pretty aggressively in a way that uh, made him stand out and I think could get him more attention going forward.